Good evening, everyone. It's Led Zamplet here. We are returning back to our series we are doing on Napoleon Total War, the Spanish Ulcer, which is uh, Total War's representation of the Peninsular War between the French forces of Napoleon, the Kingdom of Spain and Portugal, and me, the player, being the British. So when last we were here, we had just taken Salamanca. And this French army under Sully is currently out and about. Um, I'm probably going to strike him with this army and finish him off. We need to go ahead and plan our next objective, which I believe should be Valladolid, which is here in Castilla la Vieja, Old Castile. And I believe I've got enough forces here in Gibraltar to affect an invasion of Granada. So let's go ahead and start with that. General Pakenham's troops are going to advance from Granada, uh, from Gibraltar towards Granada. And they will be supported by the Royal Navy. Doesn't look to be anyone. Looks like Grenada or Granada is completely. Your orders, your Where are you going? Let's go ahead and have you take out this port. This land is ours by right. All right, we've got a spy. Well, he's a provocateur. All right, so let's go ahead and send some forces to wipe out this French army here. Yeah, let's auto resolve this battle. We so we're gonna go ahead and begin a guerrilla war against these manufacturing centers. We got a supply post here. I've got a small guerrilla army here with uh, two battalions or two regiments of Cazadors and some light cavalry, some light hussars. In the meantime, General Wellington's army is. Uh, pretty depleted right now, so um, we're going to stick here and rearm ourselves before we march on Valladolid. And I think the Spanish need to go ahead and kind of bolster their defenses of, of Salamanca. They had only recently taken it, so... I uh, got 14 grand. Let's go ahead and end this turn. So my reinforcement armies are moving towards the front lines. Currently have direct control of two provinces in Portugal. Got French forces on the move here along the front line in Old Castile. Alright, let's go ahead and raid the supply post. And let's go ahead and attack this unit here. So we got a guerrilla action. I'm using my Spanish guerrillas to attack behind the lines in Old Castile. We have an army under Julian Sanchez. Alright, so we're going to spread them out so they don't get jacked up by artillery fire. And uh, let's put our horses over here. General Sanchez over here and begin the battle. All right, infantry, go ahead and move up. Take out those fusiliers of the line. And then my cavalry will move over here, which will give them defilade against small German co or Russian column, excuse me, um, French column of artillery and infantry.
Let's accelerate this. All right. Okay, enemy infantry is on the move. And I'm going to send my cavalry here. And they're going to charge out those guns. Move it, move it, move it. Okay, they are in position. Take out those guns. Here comes my cavalry about to charge these guns. Here they come. Charge! Oh man, they got blasted in the face. Got blasted in the face with can it with a canister shot. I lost a couple guys there. And their artillery is holding out pretty well. Alright. Charge the enemy. So this is a successful guerrilla action by my uh, Spanish troops. Oh, they're for trying to form a square. Did they form a square in time? Okay, my skirmishers are pouring some fire on them. They're almost starting to break. General, get up there. Support your troops immediately. Get up there, General. Got him on the run. All right. Battle one. We destroyed a column of French reinforcements moving through... Uh, well, I don't think it's Old Spain. I think it's uh, Leon. Excellent work, troops. All right, so my army's still encamped over here. Got reinforcements coming up. Uh, let's go ahead and work on infrastructure. Starting with uh, better roads. And how are we doing over here? Yes. Troops forward! All right, General Packnam is moving into Grenada. He's going to threaten Grenada over here. And we got reinforcements moving to supply General Wellesley's army and General Garcia's army before we begin our advance on Valladolid. And it looks like we've already... That province is currently in near revolt. Um, let's infiltrate. Okay, that city's in revolt. It's current. There's currently nobody in it. I'm, I'm tempted to ambush this column.
you know, let's play it cautious for now. Let's play it cautious for now. See what this army of kind. Of, I don't want to put myself. Exp I don't want to expose my flank to an attack from Madrid. Maybe the French are concentrating an army north of Madrid. We have a duel. I am being challenged by... Well, let's, let's use pistols. never seen that before. Oh, so he's wounded? Is that it? Oh, man. I would have hoped for uh, my duel to have been a lot more violent than that. Forwards! Forwards! Yes, sir. Your Majesty. Okay, so I've got a almost entirely a Portuguese army here. Okay. And uh, let's see, I got foot, foot, KGL, King's German Infantry. Okay, I think we're good. I got plenty of money. Let's go ahead and build a drill school. I think we are good here. Oh, I still could probably am well, I can't ambush that column now. Okay. All right, what's your army doing? Go ahead. See if you can Um, let's see, can I run all these militia off? A mob. Let's do it. Let's assault this position. I have trained infantry, and all I gotta do is take out a mob. Let's give him a whiff of grape. I don't have artillery. All right, let's start this battle. Advance, general advance. Let's, let's destroy this rabble. Charge them out. All right, boys. Charge them out. Crush this mob. Oh, I lost two men. Oh, that was a costly charge. Charge 
Charge him out. Roll him up. Excellent work. Excellent work. Continue to march upon the enemy and eliminate them. Come on, destroy this enemy infantry. Only a mob. Oh shit. Get in there. Alright, good work, good work. I, I've got two, I don't have much cavalry left. All right, excellent work. Continue rolling up the enemy. Who's running? Oh, they are. Okay, go ahead and finish up this enemy. These are my skirmishers. Look at them in their bowler hats. Or in their top hats. They look fabulous. Well, they got a mix of hats. We got a couple with bicorn hats. Oh, shit. Burn and open fire on them. Fire. Keep up a hot fire, boys. Keep up a hot fire. Keep those barrels hot. Oh, shoot. He died. What are we doing over here? Charge him out. One of our units has used all its ammunition, sir. Charge him out, General. Excellent work. This General Garcia, I think is his name, whatever, he is uh, excellent. Cavalry General. Brave fire. Warm up. Crush him. Fire. Fire. They're charging. All right, this battle is one in hand. So, this is a particularly bloody battle, actually, for the size of it. I mean, there's a lot of dead on the ground. All right, well, how about that? General Sanchez, Julian Sanchez. He has just libera liberated Old Castile, which was the next objective of this army. So that was pretty fortuitous. And we have re recruited another guerrilla leader. Let's see if he can, uh, can he recruit any? Your Majesty. Uh, 
Well, he'll go ahead and... Okay. All right. So I lost a lot of cavalry in that engagement. I got a French army here, which is a concern. How are we doing down here? Let's press her advantage. Uh, let's see if I can attack Grenada. So I've liberated Old Castile for Spain. Let's see what happens next. You have French armies that are moving across the those mountains over there. All right, what's the result of this duel? <sighs> Not this again. Okay, we've got a pretty large French army there. A uh, very large French army on the move. I lost track of it at Cordoba. Okay, so do we need to reposition north to Cordoba to intercept this French army on the move? All right, so Pakenham has moved his army here. Let's go ahead and start recruiting. We got some good money now. We can go ahead and start recruiting more cavalry. Let's get some light dragoons and two more line infantry. And, uh, okay, so we are now in a position to protect Cordoba against this enemy army. Okay, up here in the north, we're going to continue. We've got an objective to capture, capture Santander and Cantabria. So these are my guerrilla forces. They're currently they're currently dispersing to keep an eye. So I'm I'm pushing deep into Spain towards the upper Ebro. And I just uncovered a bevy of French forces here. So, how's my armies? They are still recovering. I'm going to move him back so he can recover his troops faster. I, I suspect that if I'm in my own territories, I can recover my troops quicker. Um... Am I now able to recruit another general? I can. General Picton, but I cannot afford him. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and fall back. I'm going to keep my guerrilla forces on the move, just sacking all of these uh, French centers of production. And I think I can actually start building up a navy. Let's uh, t let's take a look up the coast here. Rob, 
So I can start raiding these French ports. We got a large French army here. In Mercia. Or Mercia, as you might pronounce it. Now let's go ahead and end our turn. Okay, the French are besieging uh, forces in Old Castile. They have recaptured it. Okay, next time I'll just plunder it. So we got large French forces here in Valladolid, placing, uh, let's see, how are these armies supplying? This army is ready to go into position to protect the city. I'm going to let his armies recover a little bit more. General Diaz is going to raid Benevente in Leon and march south to protect. Well, he's going to, I don't want him to get trapped, so his army is going to retreat back towards Salamanca. Here we've got an, we've got a sizable French army that I am keen on destroying. Ooh, I'm outnumbered. Let's uh let's fall back. All right, so I, I actually retreated from battle. I did not like those odds. Okay, I think that's it. Let's end this turn. Got ourselves a battle here. All right. General Peral is attacking Pakenham's army. This is a defensive battle. And this is going to be a tough one. Position my artillery on this hill. Stop. Good artillery sighting. want you to move into those woods. King's German Legion on the right. Second Brigade on the left. Second Brigade on the left. Third Light Brigade on the left. Calvary on the right. 
artillery position here, general position here, begin battle. Okay, I wish for my light infantry to position themselves on the left in those woods. is starting to take position and that's a lot of regular infantry shoot now howitzers Guns have range or not? Six pounder artillery, I do not have range. All right, let's accelerate this battle. And my boys over here are under artillery fire. Limber up, boys. Let's move. Let's move the guns up. General, stop. Limber those guns, boys. Move up here. the hell are you guys pushing this? That's what you got horses for. Go ahead and unlimber. Open fire. Okay, light infantry is now engaged on the left flank. What is your concern? Alright, fall back. These guys are shaky. I don't know why. They've got low morale. Let's get this general up here. Kind of buck up those troops. Okay, this light infantry is doing a great job. Okay, fall back. Enemy is making a strong push on the left. Get up there, General. I need you to keep those troops bucked up. Okay, pull back. What are we doing over here, boys? Okay, we got artillery that's blasting these positions here. 
uh, infantry is moving into position. Charge out. Oh, shit. Charge out. Charge out this enemy cavalry. Yeah, I'm charging across the face of the enemy. This isn't good. Yeah, that was that was stupid of me. Never charge across the face of the enemy. And I made that mistake. Get into position, man. General, you gotta fall back. Fall back, General. Switch to canister. Okay, I got canister fire. Our men are running. I know they're running. Come on, open fire. Hit them with canister. Boom, boom. Uh, look at how many guys I just plowed down. Jeez. Keep up a hot fire, boys. I'm getting flanked over here. Keep up that hot fire, man. I got an enemy in my rear. My general is in trouble. I'm getting out flanked. Turn around, fire on them. My left is getting chewed alive. Not good. I'm at deeply outflanked by the enemy. I need to effect a withdrawal of my army if I'm gonna save myself. Alright. I'm gonna lose the guns, but I need everyone else to retreat. Fall back. I'm gonna lose the guns, but... Alright, my army is retiring. In... Terrible disorder. Devastating loss, devastating loss. You ready to go to bed? Oh, you're watching me, okay. All right, so that army, I've only got 270 men left, but that army is wiped out. Not good, not good. Gibraltar is open to invasion. So we need to immediately... recruit ourselves... two brigades of infantry, six-pounder artillery, light dragoons, and we'll have ourselves a commander in the next turn. So we're raising an army pretty quickly in about a month and a half in terms of game time. Now, we got a Spanish army down here that I wish they had supported me when I got my butt kicked over here at Cordova. 
but there's sufficient Spanish forces in the south to where they, they should be able to hold their own. I mean, they got a big army here in Sevilla and an army in Granada. All right, General Wellesley, I will probably give him about another turn to have his army decently supplied. I got a chance to cut off some uh, French reinforcements here. So let's go ahead and do that. Auto resolve that. Okay, so we uh, destroyed a French uh, reinforcement column there on the road between Madrid and Castile. Let's see here. All right, let's go ahead and end this turn. Uh-oh, we got major French armies moving in from the lower Ebro River. Uh-oh, let's retreat. All right, so that's Guerrilla action there, I retreated from a confrontation there. It's like the Spanish tried to attack Grenada, but failed in that. Continue raiding deep into enemy territory. So I'm raiding deep into Spain, into the upper Ebro River. These guys need to recruit more. Wish I could recruit more Cazadors. Well, we're going to keep him raiding across the border here. This land is ours. Now, I thought I saw a large French army moving its way down from Galicia. So, just in case, I'm going to send Wellesley up here to cover this bridge. And this may be it. That's a large French army there. All right, I think I got enough money to recruit a general, and we want General Picton. Okay, so we're rebuilding our army after a devastating loss of Pakenham's army here. We've already got troops that are uh, pouring into Gibraltar. Spanish or General Diaz is dead. Oh shit. Let's hire another general. Can I get a Okay, let's go ahead and retreat this army. We just got ambushed. All I was doing is just scouting with this army. Let's auto resolve that battle. Yeah. That is a defeat, hard defeat. Okay, so we got a, we've got an army over here in in Galicia that could pour into this um, 
Jeez, I don't know what river this is. The Guadalajara or like a pour across this river. So I'm gonna cover these two river crossings from Valladolid. Alright, let's go ahead and I'm starting to get pretty good money here. Let's go ahead and start choking off French trade. So I've burned down these ports, and I've got several other ports I could raid up this coast. So that's what I'm going to go ahead and do. So let's go ahead. Go ahead and raid this port up here. Is everything okay? Are you just watching me? Okay. Got my son over here who's shadowing me. He's been watching my stream. He's probably the only one watching the stream right now. Oh, well that's cool. Alright, um... Let's go ahead and end this turn. I got plenty of money. I'll just use that as just financial reserves. Okay, that French army is not attacking towards uh, my supply lines to Salamanca. We got large French forces positioning in... Valladolid. Okay, General Picton's army is now ready to go. And he can go ahead. I can I can build a pretty darn big army over here. Gibraltar may be a great place to launch a base of operations. Simply because it can recruit so quickly. Um, geez, have I not been researching anything all this time? Oh, gosh. That's ridiculous. So handicapped. All right, a military port complex. Let's go with that. 4500 bucks. And I'll tell you what, we're going to take a little break right now. So, um, I am going to run to the little boys room and I will be right back. Okay, and we are back. So, what do we got here? Large French army operating in Old Castile. Track. 
General Wellesley is still anchoring his army on Salamanca. Spanish doesn't even Spanish don't even look like they bothered to garrison. I mean, apparently the Spanish have left it up to me to, to guard Salamanca. And if Salamanca falls, I'm going to take administration of it when I recapture it. All right. Let's take a look at our recruitment here. Some heavy dragoons. Currently got, okay, so I need some light infantry, so let's get some KGL light infantry here. All right, let's end this turn and let things develop. And we're going to crack open a beer. Still got French forces collecting in the north. No, Picton died. What the heck? No, no. Do I have any agents? Someone assassinated my general. And now I need a new general. I'm going to go with... Uh, General Adolf Adolphus Frederick. I need an agent. Where are my agents? Gorilla Arrow, what does he do? Can he kill people? No me canso tan fácilmente. I don't know what a gorilla gorillero does, however you pronounce it. I've got a spy here in Madrid. What I need to do is have this spy protect Gibraltar. So that's going to be a long trip, but you need to move your butt out there. Why didn't I just move him? Let's move him. I don't need you to protect your lordship. Yeah, that's fine. Just go back and uh, I have no eyes up north here.
French are a lot of supp a lot of French are moving along that road. Strike at these isolated columns. Okay. Excellent. I've got another spy. Let's duel with them. That was embarrassing. Okay, I need you to recruit another light infantry unit. want to send out a cavalry patrol. I think I'm ready to strike out at these isolated units here. Your Majesty. Do that. Okay, so Wellesley is going to strike out at these isolated units. We're going to auto resolve that. Now that may draw a reaction from the French that I, I'm a little bit exposed here. And I wish I could get some more of these Spanish guerrilla leaders. All right. Ready for so, General Sanchez is raiding all up the e upper Ebro River. We're going to continue raiding up the coast here. I'm going to send a frigate to... So we're going to continue our blockade of the French coast. I think I'm probably ready to build another ship. Alright, let's end this turn. Let's hope Wellesley doesn't get cut off. Yeah, yeah, oh, enemy is moving to cut off Wellesley. He's currently dangerously exposed. Go ahead and build. Go ahead and build another thirty eight gun frigate. Build two of them. So that's my naval expenditures, and their purpose is to raid up the north coast of Spain. Captain. 
All right, so we are raiding the French coast, or the French occupied coast. All right, so we're doing a great job raiding the French coast, the French occupied coast. Okay, Wellesley is in danger. If you can see here, he's currently got a zone of control all around him. So what I want to do is eliminate this isolated army under Hoche. I mean, that's costing me a lot of men. Okay, so I've fallen back to Salamanca, but that cost me a lot of men. Yes, yes, Gosh. And I need a third army up here. Okay. This army is just about ready to make its move. Not good. Not good. Retreat. Okay, so French army has just moved to intercept me. And I'm going to lose General Sanchez. Large French army just wiped out my raid of General Sanchez. Another damn agent up there. Okay, this army is ready to move north to Sevilla. Hell is this guy? Oh, he's a provocateur. Man, I could use some more Spanish generals on horseback. Those guys really came in handy. Alright. I got two thousand bucks. That's a good amount of money to hold in reserve. What do you require? Spying. Let's end this turn. The French Navy is not really doing anything, so I do not need to improve my dry dock. Okay, I think it is now time to go ahead and recruit a new general. General Colville, and go ahead and start recruiting some troops. Concerned about the situation in the north, while the Spanish do nothing over there. How's my army replenishing? It's trying to get there. 
Spanish are not garrisoning their own damn city. Just in case. March there. What would it take for me to transfer this army north? Well, I can't safely do so. Because idiot here is whole, is in way in the way of the bridge. All right, we're just going to hold here. <sighs> I'd like to transfer that army north. I want to focus all my efforts north. Okay, go ahead. All right, let's end this turn. Oh, the French are moving south. It still won't get the hell out of the way. We shall win. Okay, let's raid these ports again. How are we doing here? Do we have a fleet built yet? No, we do not. Okay, how's this army doing? Got Portuguese militia. Ready and waiting for all. Immediately. All right, so we're going to position them in Punta de Lima, and this army. Consisting of a division. A light division of infantry. And polishing it off in eight turns, I'll have eight Casadors. Okay. All right, satisfied with those dispositions? Let's end this turn. Spain is once again ridiculously inactive. Okay, I'm going to move this army back to Gibraltar. How's this army building up? I think it's good enough to position over here. And begin concentrating an army here at Salamanca.
I should have some. Do I not have a merchant ship now? Let's go ahead and just invest in a merchant ship. I need money. With money, I can make as many armies as I need to. I could use more spies. I'd like to see what's going on up north. I'm going to need two armies. One to take on Valladolid while the other one plugs this gap from Madrid. It's late May. Got another 38 gun frigate. I'm going to send it north to raid these Spanish ports, or these French ports in Galicia. Alright, that army is covering that bridge. Several troops that are... Just don't have any offensive capabilities right now. Um, I think I'm... If I could transfer this army north... Looks like I can. Oh, I can. God damn it. The Spanish army is just sitting on this bridge. I have no choice, probably, but to march on Cordova with the army that I've got, which is not a very experienced army, I might add. Hmm. Perhaps I can transfer them by fleet. All right, let's send them back to Gibraltar, and we'll we'll think about that. In the meantime, Make ready. What? What? your hump, hump, sir. Hmm. Pushing into Valladolid, that certainly creates a salient. But I clear out my flanks first. With an offensive towards Leon. Or... Should I ex show my displeasure with the lack of Spanish assistance in garrisoning Salamanca that I just withdraw completely and take Galicia. Let's do a mass transfer of an army. This will take about a month. Two months. You stay here and garrison Salamanca. We're going to shore up our flank. Wellesley is going to take Santiago de Compostela. Compostela. Tigran. And 
And let's end our turn. We've got a major, major French concentration here on the road between Old Castile and Madrid. All right, so. Willis Lee's marching north. Go with a ooh, banking house. Sounds sounds nice. Well, that looks nice too. A military academy. Let's go with that, and then we'll go with the banking house next. There is a large French army somewhere over here. A bit concerned about that. I want to be prepared to retreat from Salamanca. That's what he can do. He can uh, harass the French. I see. All right, but he did spot a French army over here. Another French army. All right. I think we can probably end this turn. see Mercia being defended at all. Okay, I think we're good. So let's turn. French are moving to attack Salamanca. So there's hardly any roads. It's going to take a whole month to travel through primitive roads. In the meantime, there's a French army that's advancing from here. And I'm not too keen on that. I don't know. 
I don't feel comfortable. We may get attacked in the next round, so I don't want him to move. I want him to hold. He's going to retreat back to territory. Meantime, I'm not sure what to do here. ¿Cómo puedo ayudarle a este humilde siervo? Será un placer ir hasta allí, señor. A Cordova, it's like ripe for the taking. I'm not prepared to take that risk just yet. French action going on up north. That's not good. Looks like a giant ass army is moving to reinforce Galicia. Okay, there it is. Salamanca's besieged. And my army is going to withdraw. These armies need to be mutually supporting. Yes, I need a banking, another banking house. All right, here we go. Okay, raiding that supply port. Got a merchant ship here. We're going to send you to here. All right. So I have with. The enemy has taken Salamanca. I have withdrawn my armies to the border here of Bebra. Down here in the south, i am got a lot of inaction here. I am concerned about... Concerned about a major French army... You know, I just I just can't contemplate this in action. Let's go ahead and send this army up towards Cordoba. Fucking Spanish are completely inactive. Salamanca, I will return to Salamanca once I've shored up my flank here. Here we go, end of turn. Okay, here comes the French army. Ready and awaiting orders. Prepare the troops for battle. Troops for battle. Troops for battle. We need to go ahead and take them out now. All right, here we go.
French had just reinforced themselves in time with an artillery battery. His effectiveness is not going to be great in the middle of the shitty weather. Holy smokes. This is good ground right here. I don't like the ground I'm starting out with. Here we go. First Brigade on the right. Standard formation here. Second Brigade on the left. Third Brigade on the left. Light Infantry. On the left. Light infantry, perhaps as a reserve on the deep left. General, right here. KGL, all right, so I got enough to basically make a light division. Fourth division is a light division, and then we got some dragoons here. We'll leave these dragoons here on the far left. Start this battle. Okay, move up. Light division advance. Artillery, move up. Occupy this hill. First Brigade on the right. Second Brigade advance. Third Brigade advance. General Wellesley move up here. Ship. Look at that. We got dudes behind us. Holy shit. I'm outflanked. How about that? God, they're shooting my guns. Okay, your division halt, 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 halt. Hang on, fall back, withdraw. I'm about to blunder. I'm about to blunder. Halt. All units halt. Okay. Unlimber guns. Position immediately. Reverse your brigade. Open fire. You switched to chain shot. Just keep a good hot fire up on them. In the meantime, we're taking artillery fire from behind. General Wellesley, charge them out. Calvary, charge them out. Charge out those guns.
Yeah, we got a good hot fire going on. Move your brigade up. Come on, guys, get your asses over there and charge them out. Okay, third division, go ahead and advance, make a general advance, push them off this hill. Hard them out. Pushing them back. Cavalry has finally arrived. Take out those guns if you can, mates. I don't expect those guys to last. Alright, reposition all units. Limber the guns. Limber all the guns. Retire, reform. Regroup the army. The enemy is attacking our 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 flank here. But look at him! Holy shit! Look how brave these men are. Our men are running. All right. Let's reposition our guns. We have a French army that my cavalry just did a heck of a job on. That's attacking my my flank from the if you can see here from the southeast. So I've got to reposition my army here. Sacrifice my cavalry. Move your brigade up immediately. They're moving in fast. They're moving in very fast. Switch to canister. Okay, I got a strong reserve on my right. Very strong reserve on my right. No, there's a lot of men that died here. Shit, a lot of British died here. This has been a bloody battle. Alright. Go ahead and envelop these fools. Rise up. Line 
Uh, reform your division. Move up reserves. Okay, that's it. That should be battle. Excellent work. Galithia is ours. Glorious victory! It's a costly one. 20% casualties. I'm not ready to liberate it. We're going to occupy this. This is under British administration. So we've now placed Galicia under British administration. On deck. Prepare for action, you scurvy dog. Over here, got our army that's collecting. So I've secured my flank into Portugal. We're taking a chance and occupying. We're going to auto-resolve this. And I'll tell you what, I am not keen to liberate this for Spain. Prepare to loot it. I'm going to return it to Spanish control. If I put it to Spanish control, then they might move forward their armies to cover it. So let's see if they do that. I've, it was one at a cheap cost. I've got a new guerrilla leader. I love that. So let's go ahead and Just move them over here. We're going to move uh, this provocateur to La Mancha. And we are going to replenish our army here of Adolf of General Frederick. We're going to naval raid again. Just 
continuing to burn these dockyards and ports every time the French... Alright, how are we doing over here? My gosh, he can recruit just about anybody he wants to. Holy smokes. Well, that's pretty doggone nice. Well, I'll tell you what. Um, uh, he can... Uh, he can't recruit anybody up there. Your orders, Your Majesty. Your Majesty. Shit. Look at all the stuff he can recruit. Highlanders? Yes, yes. Are you fucking kidding me? Can you get some Highlanders? You get some Highlanders. Alright. Let's see what the Spanish do. I'm more interested to see what the Spanish do. See whether they move to color, cover... Uh, um... Hell, I can't even remember the name of the city now. Doba. Oh my gosh, we've got a naval engagement with a French squadron off the coast. Alright, let's do it. Alright boys, do the Royal Navy proud. The HMS Good Hope. Steady boys. Oh shit, we're taking fire, steady boys. Steady, steady, steady. Steady. Fire. This is not good. We're taking heavy fire. Taking a lot of hits. A sloop and a th another 38 gun frigate. Come about. Just coming about. HMS Good Hope. Coming about. Gonna nail her with the uh, starboard guns. We got weather gauge again. Good shots. Good shots. You gotta keep a hot, hot fire, boys. Whoops. Still got the weather gauge. How many guns have I got? I got twenty two of my thirty eight guns. Go ahead and try and flee this battle. And that's just not being cowardly, that's just preserving force. 
French keep trying to out turn me. I'd love to start a fire on this deck. battles last in a while. Alright, she's gonna come about. Bad shape. He needs to she needs to retreat. Alright, so the Cape of Good Hope is withdrawing. It's uh withdrawing down when being chased. It was not a disgraceful performance by the Good Hope. The Fendone and the Fendon. The fleet is lost! Ah, the ship. Okay. Alright. We got a French fleet that is running rampant in the north. This is not good. Okay, so we have a new dimension to the war in the north. Thank you, Your Majesty. Fleet ready. Okay, we got French raiders operating in the North Atlantic. So we've got a problem here because that now I've got one thirty eight gun frigate here. Got this seventy four gun frigate here. I'd rather have these frigates. We need more frigates. We've got a major war going on up north. Have I got a lot of money now? Thank you, British government. metaled roads, but we've got a French army that's dickering around down here, so let's just go out and stop it right quick. We are triumphant. Troops forward. He can go ahead and recruit some Highlanders.
as well as more KGL. But let's work on our infrastructure because we've got quite a bit of money here. It's a lot of money to spend for not a whole lot of benefit. Then now I gotta determine my next objective in the north now that I've secured that flank. I need a fleet. I need to keep building a fleet. What can you build here? Hell yeah. That's a pretty good deal there. 1200 bucks? Yeah, let's get that military supply port. Alright, what do we got here? We got another merchant ship. Let's go down there. Need an admiral. And let's go with General, uh, or excuse me, Admiral Jervis. Actually, Admiral Duckworth. With uh, three 38 gun frigates. And then we'll sweep north. What are the Spanish done over here? What does he do? That's what I don't understand a provocateur. You do. All right, anyway. Hey. You can probably start raiding into La Mancha. This is a good road to launch an ambush, so let's move your forces over here. You can use that to ambush anyone coming down this road. Yes. His army is still highly inexperienced. Leave him to cover this bridge. Big French army there. Big French army there. I'm a little bit exposed here in the south. Your 
Okay. Maybe good. Maybe I can build the damn dockyard. What's a dockyard get me? I get a fourth rate. I get a third rate. Well, let's do that. Fifteen hundred bucks. All right. So the French have, are are engaging in some major commerce raiding. It's really busting my balls right now. And there's a French army. Oh, let's see. I don't know what any of this shit means. Okay, whatever. But... We've got a problem because there's a French army somewhere in here. We've got to fall back. Shit. Maybe we could trap this piece of shit army that's... Let's cut them off. There's a French army operating in this mountain pass. Got some regular Spanish infantry I'm recruiting here in the far north, which I'm going to use that to help garrison Galicia. Okay, what I'm doing is I'm, I'm gonna, there's a French army operating here, and I'm going to try and envelop and trap him and destroy it. General Frederick is still encamped here in this river. Yes. He is going to set up an ambush here. You need to continue to... I need you to support this army.
that French fleet just really, really caused some problems for me because now I'm about to be bankrupt on account of no fucking money. Um... It's all that. I need the money. There he is. He's demanding the surrender. No, I ain't gonna fucking surrender. Oh, shit. Battle-hardened infantry. It's ought to resolve this. Okay, so the French have, have cut me off. We're going to besiege North. Okay. I think these dispositions are good for me to actually call it a night. What time is it? Mm, 10.40. Yeah, I do need to go ahead and call it a night. Appreciate you guys watching. As the situation stands, the French have launched an invasion and conquered Nort. And I've currently got them besieged and will begin this... Uh, We'll begin the next chapter with shoring up this beachhead I've got on the Iberian Peninsula. Amber alert. We we'll pray everything's all right with with that situation. Um, anyway, so appreciate you guys watching. This concludes this chapter of the Spanish Ulcer. And uh, we'll talk with you guys soon. Thanks a lot for watching.